What did we do last night? What did we do? <laughs> Lila, no. I'll give you a hint. Oh, man. Ready? Yeah. Lila, that's it. What are we eating tonight, Connor? We're eating hot dogs like and cheese sticks. And there's Mama right there. Hi. And and some chicken wings. We'll set up that camp. Oh. Area over there. Yep. And we're and we're laying some. Get the mister some, going. And we're laying some poles, and we have a mister going. Yeah, we laid some poles today. Used the tractor. And we oh, and we set these steps up at the pool. It looks like a mylar balloon through here. Yeah. Yeah, a kite wouldn't rock like that. Oh yeah, I see Havelina up right there. Let's just move this down. Yay! Tilt it. Let it go. Sit. Here's the hole. Tilting it. Tilt it. So we got this uh, stock tank here as our summer project. It uh, holds 700 gallons of water, and we're not going to use it for livestock. We're going to actually turn it into a swimming pool. And our son's already having a great time with it. <laughs> But uh, we're looking forward to starting this project. We're going to have it about right here. We're going to clean up the space back there and prepare a pad for it and paint it up really nice. Build a deck behind it, maybe. And we plan to put a, like a cheap pool filter pump on it. And it'll be like our, our farmhouse pool here on Saguaro Farm. We have a buyer for our emu eggs. They want five eggs at $20 a piece. That'll pay for their food. Yeah, there's already a one. Oh, there. That's a little dirty. Everybody saw you. <laughs> he like peeked out. What did we do last night? What did we do? <laughs> Lila, no. I'll give you a hint. Oh man. Ready? Yeah. Lila, that's it. Yeah. It's just weird the tractor isn't strong enough to pull it up. Yeah, I know. That doesn't make sense to me. It kills the engine. Jeez. So it's not stuck on anything? No, it just, it's stuck digging down. It's stuck digging. Jeez. So it meant you went too far? Yeah. Dug too far. Yeah. Come on. Is it budging at all? I think it just did a little bit. That's good. It's gonna be tedious. Here we go. Oh. Lila back. Are you trying to go back? Ow. Ow. 
Lila back. Lila, look at that. I mean, when you go, huh? The whole back wheel's off the ground. Uh -huh. That's the that's the main weight, and then the front wheel is the other weight. Yeah. Uh. So I got our tractor stuck on one of the most precarious parts of our property. And it's not the tractor, but it's the uh, digger attachment that goes with it. And I've been working to dig it out. And it's been a long, long time. I'm just digging this hole wide. And I think I'm gonna try to pull it out now. I saw in another YouTube video, that uh, some people put some blockers under these uh, attachments on the digger. So I just tried, I'm gonna try that and I'm gonna try to spin it just so it doesn't dig down any further uh, because that's how it got stuck in the first place. got this fence coming up and it's gonna end there and make a 90 we're almost done with the fencing but I've been having a lot of setbacks today yesterday and the day before with the tractor just random things going wrong and uh, this is the latest setback our auger attachment got stuck and trying to get it out, bent it. And before this, the setback, this little screw broke off and it stopped digging. So I put a new screw on there and it looks like it dug too much and got the whole thing stuck. They uh, say this is a really rookie tractor mistake. I should have known. I should have been taking it slower, lesson learned. Uh, but now we're gonna have to get a new auger attachment for the tractor. So I wanted to show you a video. These are the kind of rocks that we're removing out of this hill. 
That's a big rock. Here's another one right here. We're dealing with a lot of rocks in our climate, especially in this part of our property. Well, I just got the last hole, the last post done. Uh, this hole is super big because that's where the tractor got stuck earlier. I'm really glad we got it out and I could get it done today. And it's just in the nick of time. Looks like the rainstorms are moving in and tomorrow it's supposed to rain all day. So just a few more to go on the fence, probably another 25 posts and we're done. As always, thanks for watching Saguaro Farm. We'll see you next time. Thank you.